Hey, what's good everybody? Sabro Final 4 here. We're going to be trying out our newly made Luxray Rapid Strike Octillery Zigzagoon deck and hope for some decent results. Of course, as a stage 2 Pokemon, it's not going to go far, but hopefully we can score some wins against some of the lesser VMAX and lesser V decks, like some of the tier 2, tier 3 V Pokemon, I guess. So, I've got a horrendous start right here opening up with Shinx and Sixagoon, but that's not really the problem. The problem is this uh, hand with a bunch of supporters in it, one of the types of bad starts that I hate, seeing a bunch of supporters together that you can't really use. Uh, shuffle and draw, not going to be very effective when you shuffle and draw your whole hand in. Now my opponent forced me to play first, so we can't use them anyway. And I couldn't even attach an energy, damn it. At least if I could have attached an energy on Shinx. But it is what it is. Uh, I've got the Luxury at the very least. Search that with the Incense. I've got the Rare Candy. So at the very least, we're going to bring out the Luxray next turn. And my opponent is using Mew and Mewtwo GX. Now this card might be coming back. Mewtwo decks might be coming back in Standard as a way, I guess, to counter the Urshifu decks, both of them, since they're going to be weak to Psychic. Um, I mean, Mew and Mewtwo is very scary and expanded where it can utilize all of those extra GXs and EXs that rotate it out. So in standard, I mean, it's not going to be too great, but against Urshifu's maybe. But it's our chance here, since we don't care about, you know, any fighting weakness or anything. Uh, any psychic weakness, what I'm trying to say, then we might be, we might have the chance to beat this Mewtwo with Luxray here. Because I don't think my opponent is going to be really doing much to kill me with the Pokemon they have. Going to need a little bit of time to set up too. So, used the Martini and got another horrible set of cards. I mean, god damn it, man. I've got all those Remorades, Shinxes, seven different searching balls and we can't really see the cards that we need like you definitely need to get your small basic pokemon really early and really quickly to evolve into artillery evolve into luxury and be able to do what you're supposed to do if you can't do that it sucks even more now we top deck the speed energy so get to draw a bunch of cards not really see what we need but i guess i can use the Spinner, get lightning energy, discard it with the quick ball. And now we can search something. I would have loved to get the Remoraid, but we've got to get the Shinx just in case this dude dies. And Skyla, let's get, I mean, I guess get the Magnolia set me up for the next turn if we can't draw cards with her. And Electro Step, going to do a nice 40 damage and... Works out really well on this Pokemon. Um, since we use the like the, we have the Zigzagoons as decoys. Once you play them down, they're sort of there on the bench. Of course, you can reuse them with Scoop Up Net, but you don't necessarily need like all of them to survive. As long as you have like one or two, you can use the Scoop Up Net. So, using them as decoys with this Electro Step attack isn't too bad. Like I get to save the. Luxray here. And this is probably going to be very important as if I use the Magnolia next turn, I'm going to be forced to discard the Ordinary Rod. And once that's out of the picture, I'm going to have to get by with these two Luxrays. I mean, damn, maybe I should have grabbed like Corina or something. But we'll see what happens. Uh, my opponent has a bunch of uh, GXs there in the discard pile, but they don't really matter. So like I've said, it's our shot, it's our chance, if Luxray is going to be able to do anything against a, a deck, it's going to be this one. Right, right, so she does have three energies on the dude, using Mist Slash, going to get the KO, and get our first prize. But now hopefully it's going to be our chance to retaliate, uh, use the Ordinary Rod I guess to get the Zigzagoon if I'm not going to be able to recover Luxrays. Might as well get that dude, I guess. Evolve into the second Luxray. 
And this is it. I'm going to have to get by with these two guys now that the ordinary rod has been used. And we get an energy, which is what I really wanted. So I'm able to attack. Uh, get level ball. Let's get another Zigzagoon. Should be good. And with 250 HP, man, I really just... I would have loved to have something like a Tool Scrapper right now. But I just can't afford it in this deck. And with that annoying tool there, I won't be able to do anything. So use the Zigzagoon. I guess put a damage counter on the uh, Buzzle there, the Fermasa Buzzle. And now it's time for Scar Strikes. 200 damage on the Mewtwo. I'm pretty sure I don't have a Tool Scrapper in this deck. If we do, we have one. But I don't think I have, like I don't even remember my own deck. Um, showed you guys the deck profile. I don't think I have it over here. We just couldn't afford it with the space. So I guess I can try and just set it up so we can kill the new two with just the Zigzagoons on and get the KO like on my turn still. But since we don't have it, we can't use it. I'm going to have to make an attack and kill the new two that way. So it's very unfortunate. But we're not doing too bad. I mean, at the very least, since my opponent isn't running Arceus, then at least I know he has to get six prizes. And this is our hope, you know, using a stage two deck like this. Our advantage, you can say. All right. Now, she got the... Um, the Rillaboom out. So she's going to have Grass Energies for days now, using that for Energy Acceleration. And the dude is ready, like the uh, Buzzle. That guy's good to go as well. But, I mean, I don't necessarily think she has anything that's going to be too dangerous for me. Like, what we're going to try and do is kill this dude and then kill the Buzzle to get the victory. I mean, I do have one boss's orders. We're definitely going to save it for that purpose. In case she tries to switch one of our big guys, make sure we save it for that. Get the Tabu Coco Prism. It's great. I'll be able to get some energies. And with the Evolution Incense, finally going to get the Octillery out. So, very, very good. Now then, let's use the Zigzagoon, put a damage counter on the Mewtwo. And I wish I just... Damn it, hat more dudes but we don't I guess we're gonna have to get one energy there's only one over there anyway uh, I thought I had two. Oh well scoop up net let's go ahead and do that put the zigzagoon in hand and play you down again let's put a damage counter on Mewtwo once again and uh, before I do Karina, actually, let's not forget uh, Octillery. Get the search with that guy first. And we are going to get a Shinx. Another Pokemon to get ready. And Karina for max draw in my situation here. Four cards. Decent enough. Now, put the Zigzagoon and... A damage counter on you now. It's good that that guy has like just 260 HP. And now Electro Step for the KO. I didn't want to do it, but there isn't really any other choice. Okay. Now then. Get our first three prizes. And now we're going to focus our attention on the Furamasa Buzzwall. Just use a few scoop up nets, target the dude down, maybe even use an electro step on his ass, and just finish him off basically. Uh, play down the little stealthy hood, so I guess I won't be able to do the tricks with um, uh, Zigzagoon there. She actually used boss's orders but picked on Octillery, and I'm actually glad. If she picked on the Luxury, I was going to lose. But I guess she doesn't know that I only have two dudes in the deck. Uh, she must assume that I've got like three or four. This is a luxury deck. 
so it's perfect actually works out nicely uh, evolve into the Luxio and uh, use my stadium she had the uh, swell there but it is what it is maybe I'll play the second one eventually and now let's use Erica and quick ball discard you get another Remoraid and basically gonna go for the big attack here uh, since I've got the boss's orders I've got the Luxio I mean if she has no way to heal we can actually pull the dude and finish him off with Luxio so that just works out too place down another Mewtwo and Mew GX gonna go for a big Magnolia that's perfect it means that you probably won't be able to heal the dude with like Milo and Lana so I'm pretty sure she's gonna retreat if she doesn't then Luxio can finish this guy off so I think I've got a good checkmate here indeed indeed uh, so tag call just a uh, executor didn't have any of the tag supporters so good and it's all up to what she does here I mean she couldn't really do much she did get a bunch of prizes but like I've said, you know, if you can't really utilize that cheating Arceus, that broken Arceus, um, it, we do have a, a benefit using a stage 2 in this case. Okay, and boss's orders retreated. It's all she did. And I get my KO, and it's a victory for the Luxray deck here. So, decent little game one. Not bad. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this match. Hope you guys subscribe to the channel. Leave a like. Share this video with your friends. And I'll see you guys next time with more matches with this deck. Zabro Final Four was say.